Good day YouTubers, welcome back to another video with the electrical guide. Today I want to show you a quick tour around a standard residential panel. So let's start with the main breaker here. This is a 100 amp breaker. So the main breaker is attached to this side and this side. So each side here is 120 volts to ground, which means if it's attached to both sides, we have a potential of 240 volts. So when you see these two pole breakers, what's happening is it's attaching to each side, each bus bar, which brings 240 volts into that feed. So next we'll move on to the neutral bar. We have a neutral connection here at the top and this entire bar down the side is all neutral connections, all these screws. We've got the same thing on this side and usually these are connected. This one's connected down here with a steel bar that connects the neutrals to each other. So this is all kind of one common terminal on each side. Then we've got our ground connections. This is where we, we attach all of our bonding conductors. And we've got a couple different places that we can do that. We could even put them, a couple extra ones here and here. So they're a little bit customizable as to where they go. And I'd like to also point out back here, we've got a strap that connects the neutral bar to the back of our panel. And what that does is bond the neutral to ground here. Now this may or may not be done in your panel depending on how your system is grounded. But a lot of the times you'll get this from the manufacturer already attached. Sometimes the screw is green. Sometimes our ground connections here are also green screws, depends on the manufacturer. So if you're on one of these tabs, you're on one side, one bus bar, it's 120 volts. If you are on two, like this breaker is, you're getting 120 from each. That's a 240 volt breaker or a two pole breaker. The singles are called single, single pole and they only attach to one of the blades there. All right, so now you know what you're looking at in your panel here. So just to recap, we've got our neutral bars. These are gonna have a potential of zero volts. We've got our ground connections, also a potential of zero. They're attached together with this strap back here. And then we've got our bus bars, which are the 120 volt live, uh, hot, if you will, dangerous to touch, where our two pole or our single pole breakers snap into to feed the circuit. Thanks for watching another video with the electrical guide. Hopefully you've learned kind of what's going on in your residential panel. Hope to see you for the next one.